Hello everybody, in this video we would like to demonstrate how you can set up the parental control for your POCO M5S smartphone. So to begin with, I'll get the one question out of the way. On my left I have the POCO device, on my, uh, which will use as the child smartphone of course. And on the left I have some Motorola phone, uh, just to show you um, as the parents or supervisor device reference. Now, uh, launch the settings on your child's device and enter the Google category. In here, make sure that uh, there are no accounts linked to the system currently. If there are any, just go ahead and remove them. Next, sign into your child's account. Then enter the password for it. Uh, it is also worth mentioning that obviously the uh, password for the account used uh, cannot be known to the child since if they know it they will be able to easily uh, bypass the family or parental control restrictions. So once the account has been successfully linked, uh, let me finish this process real quick. You gotta scroll the same Google page down, go for the parental control section, tap on the get started option, choose the child or teenager. Next, select the account that you have just linked or added, then enter the credentials for the parent's account, the account that will be used for supervising your uh, child's phone. I'll enter the password for it off the screen real quick as well. Uh, well, learn what actions you will be able to perform if you uh, want to, of course, then scroll the page down, uh, confirm the linking procedure by entering the child's uh, account password once again. And then go for the allow supervision option like so. Now we'll get to wait for a little bit. And as you can see, accounts have been successfully linked. In here, you can prematurely uh, manage some restrictions, for example, allow or turn off some apps that you do not want your child to use. The same goes for the filters and content restrictions. After that, uh, Let's, let's pretend that from here you can either install Family Link on your parental device by tapping on this, uh, well, respective option, or you can do that manually, doesn't really matter. Uh, so next we'll uh, transfer ourselves to the uh, parent smartphone. As you can see, I have the Family Link application already installed, but you can do that yourself. It is not hard at all. Just open the Play Store app, make sure that your device is connected to the Wi-Fi, at the search bar, uh, type in the family link query, like so. And here you'll have the install button which you want to tap on. After that, after the app has been downloaded and installed, you gotta launch it. In here, click on yes, done. Uh, as you can see after that, the device, the child's device will be displayed right over here. You can set the daily limit limit for it, the downtime, which will simply set the time frame for the device to be locked and unaccessible. Then select and configure the app limits. Set limits, block app in general or always low. Uh, enforce some content restrictions for particular apps. Manage accounts. And open the devices section, for example, as well. If you, well, want to, of course. You can tap on a device, lock it, play sound if you are having hard times finding the phone. I'll lock it, for example. And as you can see, my Poco device gets locked. In order to access the uh, parent controls from it, you gotta know the password for the child's account or the parent's account, my bad. 
Um, so that would be it as far as the parental control goes. So thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for your attention and bye-bye.